Hey guys, this is Mr. Hogan, and I'm here to tell you 17 reasons why you should add simulations to your classroom. Alright, number one here is uh, the ability to change time. You can't do that in the real world. Number two, it works! Number three, bring the subject matter to life. Number four, it helps with problem solving. Number five, it helps develop scientific skills. Number six, possibly better than hands-on labs. Number seven, indicates that they may have actually learned better in the simulation than they did by going outside. Whoa. Number eight, it's clean, easy, time efficient, and engaging. But don't forget, it's only going to be as effective as your teaching is. Don't use it to replace traditional teaching methods. Just ask yourself, how can this simulation be used to extend what I'm already doing in the classroom? Number 12, remember to keep instruction student-centered as always. Remember to always keep students questioning and predicting as we do in the classroom every single day. And remember kids, it's just a simulation, a model of the real world, not the real world. Or is it? Number 15, make sure that content is always the focus. Don't get hung up on technological difficulties. Number 16, simulations can even be engaging after the simulation. And finally, number 17, there's tons of great information out there, so don't forget to check it out. All right, guys, that's all for today. I hope you enjoyed my video. If you had a favorite reason for using simulations in your classroom, make sure to put it in the comments and we can have a little discussion about that. Also, don't forget to like and hit that subscribe button. Peace and see you all next week.